It's just you. <laughs> yeah, he hates my voice. <coughs> he loves the food I give him. He loves me petting him and cuddling him. But the mo no, no, you know what he really hates? Fly me to the moon. Let me play. Do you see him immediately stop doing what he is doing and like yeah. looks super annoyed? He hates the sound of me singing. And I'm like, you are the only creature on the I could sing for dolphins and they'd fucking come. But you, you're just an asshole. <laughs> hey everyone. So yeah, we're gonna be playing this. Star Wars, Knights of the Old Republic. Oh yeah, you were petting my cat. You definitely need some hand sanitizer. And so my friend Draven here has never ever ever played this game and I have and we're gonna be turning this into a gaming channel so you're all gonna have to get fucking used to that because you clearly don't care about the high art that I have given you so now I'm just gonna give you garbage and appeal to the lowest common denominator while I work on my real life and get my shit back in order without having to appeal to you twats so yeah anyways we're gonna play Star Wars <laughs> I think I might qualify as one of the lowest common denominators sometimes. Uh, yeah, sometimes. But that's because yeah. I drink too much. Uh, don't we all? Don't we all? As I say, drinking out of my $185 pewter goblet that I got at the Ren Fair that's full of literally a fucking screwdriver. Oh, uh, we need to get more mead. I, I've oh. got to get more mead. We've got to do it with more mead. Where the fuck do we find that cream soda mead, mead that we had? Remember the, the orange cream soda mead? Where the fuck do we find that shit? Oh my god. We like, could ladies look for and gentlemen, it, but you'd actually have to use the computer to look at yeah, it. Yeah, like, ladies and gentlemen, think of a honey mead that tastes like an orange cream soda. It is as delectable and delighting as it, it is a treat. As, oh, it's a treat. Here's the thing about the Ren Fair each can is 14 bucks and you're expected to tip. So basically, you're paying $15 for a 12 ounce can. And. Luckily, everything there is super fun and memorable, and the chicks have the biggest titties. And if you've got $200 for mead, you're doing all right. Okay. I spent 90 on mead. So let's actually focus on the game. Okay. All right. So that guy be, in the middle. This guy, you want to be a soldier? Just a soldier? You don't want to be, like, an explorer or maybe even a skillful rogue? Oh. So each one of these are, the like, different classes that we can be to start off with. Uh... I think we should be the rogue, personally. All right, be the rogue. Uh, Who doesn't like a good old rogue, right? So we got to customize the character. I never like doing a... So should we be... Um, green skin. Oh, no, you wish we could. <laughs> I hey, wish. Dude, bro. Oh, I want to um, be... I want to... I wish one of these guys looked more like Finn. Actually... Th that looks close enough. That looks like Finn. Can, should we be Finn? I, Shorten up the jaw if you can. No, you can't. You can only use. You can just use the face. You okay. know what? As, like, don't get me wrong. Like, I mean, he looks about as much as Finn as that looks like Keanu Reeves, and people want Keanu Reeves to play this role. And I'll explain to you later on in the game why. But like, yeah, like, or, or like, I mean, that looks like every army guy you've seen in every. It fucking looks like movie. every army guy. Yeah. Let me tell you what, son. We're gonna defeat these Sith lords one way or the other. We are the Jedi Council. The bad haircuts. I can't oh, I didn't stand notice that guy had an eye scar. Actually, oh, he kind of nice. He kind of looks like uh, the Extra guy detail. from The Force Unleashed a little bit. But you know what? Let's let's make Finn a Jedi. Let's do that. I just want to point out we're not being racist here. That dude actually kind of looks like Finn. he wields this lightsaber. He should be Jedi. So let's see. We have thirty points. So charisma, wisdom, intelligence. These things are great for not only sk uh, skill modifiers. But for Jedi, force powers... Dexterity and, and wisdom. Yeah, I was thinking dexterity would be a good thing. Wisdom. Strength is like so-so. I mean, yeah, with lightsaber... It's a lightsaber, you don't really need But here's the thing, here's the thing. In this game, you could have a blaster and just shoot lightning out of your hand. So you could shoot people and then lightning people who get too close. And in the second game, oh, dude, you literally could just become a martial arts master who can shoot lightning. So imagine just like martial arting people and then lightning them. You don't even need a lightsaber. It's I really wonder why I've never played this game. Oh my god! I like that's what pisses me off. It's like, dude, how have you not played these games? But you you know about the old Republic, the MMO. You know, so we're gonna put 13, 13, 13, and thirteen on these, and then we're gonna put the rest into just Constitution. Actually, you know what? Is everything just thirteen? Uh, you bring know what? Pawn up. Get your life better than your strength. My what strength. up? 
Your con equals your life, yeah? Yeah, um... You don't need a lot of strength if you're using energy attacks. You need constitution to have the hit points. You know to what? To soak up an attack. I like that. I like that. And dexterity... We'll keep... Because we're gonna... We're gonna need them if we use blasters and grenades. That's why I hey, said... Hey, let me tell you what. You what really want to use grenades. What does wisdom govern in this game? Uh, wisdom is force powers. Yeah, that's why dexterity and wisdom... Hamboy right. Ham is commenting, always wanted them to bring the over-public MMO to consoles. That would be great, but they won't. It would be nice if they brought it up to the Xbox X and PlayStation 5 era in a remake. I think what they should do is just make a whole new fucking game. Like, I mean, they had Star Wars Galaxies. Remember Star Wars Galaxies? I did not play it, but I remember seeing it played. Yeah, me too. Uh, same here. I never even played uh, the Old Republic MMO. I've, I've only, only ever played the RPGs. I've only seen the Old Republic played for about two hours. Yeah, so make a whole new game, make it workable for consoles, make it cross-platform for all I fucking give a shit. So now we got computers. Awareness and treat injury. Well, no, you really want to put it in persuade as well. Like, let me tell you what. Oh, yeah, the force persuasion. So you can persuasion. only go to, you can only go, no, no, this isn't even force persuade. This is just regular, like, hey, how you doing? I'm super handsome and charming, and you should do what I say. Because I'm super handsome and charming. Because he's Han Solo. Because I'm Finn, and I'm super ha I mean, John Boyega, like, he kind of does, uh, like, he kind of does it for me. I'm not going to lie. It's like, he's kind of fucking cute. He's got those dick-sucking lips, you know what I'm saying? You know, okay. what's, you know what's strange is I actually fun. like a Oscar Isaac's more. He is very handsome. He's got one of those good structured faces. He that really you, does. That when you kiss him, you'd like to just feel. You just want to like hold that face. Yeah. While it, you stick your tongue down that. Throat. He's got one of those. Faces Oscar, that's if you're watching, how you doing, honey? <laughs> I love Moon Knight. You were really good. Uh, so yeah, let's put in the persuade. Oh, you can only put so many in. Yeah, for now. Okay. Yeah. So stealth awareness, persuade, and we should always injury. put at least one in stealth. Because you can use the stealth um, belt that allows you to sneak around, but only by yourself. You can't bring your team with you, and it's it's useful in some situations. You'll see. I'm so used to playing a game where it's single person adventure. What I like to do is put one into everything just to make sure I can at least Let's do anything and everything. Yeah, exactly. At least at a small level. You have no idea. How oh, much I demolitions? Know. Oh, I'm a demo expert. I know how much it points in demo. And work. I'm also gonna put this last one in probably True. security. Oh, we, oh, we will need to hack panels. Oh, that's what that is for. So okay. much, so much hacking. So we have one feet. I usually don't like to go into armor because I use force lightning, and the heavier armor uses metal. And you can't use force lighting with metal. That's, so he's that's, a druid. Gotcha. I mean, literally, that's why Vader doesn't use force lightning. Because he would short circuit himself. His, it's basically a druid. You use yeah. metal armor, you're fucked. Yeah. So what, I is, like, what is the X? So I um, X is critical strike, but I like to put in empathy, because empathy gives you an extra point to persuade awareness and treat injury. Put it there. Yeah, that's yeah. useful. Exactly. Oops. Yeah. And then... Um, well, his name is Finn. Well, wait, hold on. Before we do that, Dendo of Bal. Crassy... I don't even know how to do that. Crassy Sock. Trico Denegan. Look at these names. London Cost. See? Crystal Dell. Lenic Venice. Fanacora. Yak Char. Well, that's, ja that's Jack Char, baby. That's Jack Char. I Yo, did what's say it with a J. I'm Jack Char. That's that'd be a great name. But let's just make him Finn because he looks kind of like he, he, like. I mean, yeah, let's do it. Those are some good names. I'm able to pronounce some of them properly. I always try to pronounce them as like the whitest person possible. Oh, luckily for me, I'm anything but the average white person. Let's make Finn finally a Jedi because he deserves it. He deserves recognition for his. Fucking like, I've had to explain... Oh, yeah, shit. No, no, no. no. I don't want the audio. There we go. Okay, cool. We're good. Ah, oh, yeah. So I had to explain to this guy why people, like, hate the pre or the sequel trilogy so much. And the actual characters. It's basically, it boils down to there's just no direction. The characters are all over the place. And there was clearly things promised that never were fulfilled. Like, Finn has the Force. But we never see him become a Jedi. No, it's the white girl who becomes a Jedi. Yeah, it's a little fucked up. Hmm. 
And then to solve the um, the love triangle between Finn and and Rose and Ray is just add another black chick who is basically Finn and even kind of looks like him a little bit. Also, there's a whole bunch of things going on here that I usually read out in a voice. Crushing all the resistance, Malik's war on conquest has left the Jedi scattered and vulnerable as countless knights fall in battle and many more swear allegiance to the new Sith Master. In the skies above the outer rim world of Terrace, the Jedi battle fleet against the forces of Darth Malak and a desperate attack to the Sith. Basically, there's a Dark Lord who had a different Dark Lord, but he defeated his Dark Lord, like Palpatine style, and is now, like, fucking everything up, and that's where we start. Interesting. There's I always, always found the Lord. opening crawl, while iconic, completely unnecessary. It's more expositional nonsense. Yeah, it sometimes. really is. It's really just a character talking to your face, and you're like, "Yeah, this is what's going on, bro." Just to explain the first. That's five why minutes of I why did like how um, I think it was Rogue One that opened with no title crawl, and I'm like, "Yeah, why yeah, would it?" I think it was Rogue One. Yeah. Like, why would it need one? You, if you don't get what Rogue One is about just from the content, like, what war is this? What era is this? It uh, predates the destruction I mean, literally, of Darth Vader and Princess Leia show up at the end, so if you can't figure it out, you are the retardedest Link. Goodbye. No offense it's like to a anyone who has actually, mental retardation. Like, yeah, no, actually, full offense. Fuck you. Why are you even watching YouTube? You should be drooling on something. What? I'm offensive? Uh, yeah, you like that, don't you? You wanted a Joker that says the N-word until he actually existed. You know, I hope Joker says the gamer word. Joker needs to say the gamer word. Well, I said the gamer word and you got all mad. Anyways, he looks like a young Finn, if anything. He does. Yeah. Like, uh, I like I like this because it's like, who are you? The end are spy. It's like, we should know where we are. Maybe he has a head injury or something. I'm your bunkmate here on the Endar Spire. We work opposite ships. I guess that's why you haven't seen me before. Now hurry up. We have to find Bastila. We have to make sure she makes it off the ship alive. Okay. Who, who, who is Bastila? <coughs> Dude, that's just... One of our primary duties is to guarantee her survival in the event of an enemy attack. Ashley, Bastila, don't get me wrong. She starts off as kind of a cunt, but she becomes like... The best. <laughs> I, I love all this exposition shit. Like, I know all about your reputation. And then he repeats your reputation to you. Yeah, that's... I love that shit. That's like that first time I played Halo Fall of Reach. And the one guy is talking about his background. I've seen all of your file, even the deleted parts and shit. And it's like, what, is he better than Master Chief then? Right, yeah, no, I want to know what those deleted parts are. <laughs> I want to know what the fuck that was. All right, let's go help Basila. I wish I was actually a black man because now all this just seems like virtual blackface. Is that a thing? Probably. Who cares? Let's do it, baby. Look at that tight ass. Yeah. Oh, God. Actually, I usually play as a female character, but, you know, it'd be fun to play as a male this time around. And I, I've probably never played it as a black character. Why? Because I'm a white guy, and I'm sure most black guys never play as white characters unless they have to, which they probably do a lot when you think about it. But, like, you think any black guy has booed up GTA Online and made a white guy character? Probably not. I'm, I'm just saying, probably what do you not. got? What do you got? You got a blaster. Yeah, let's go with the blaster for now. Stealth field generator is exactly what it sounds like. What Works I think the next... Feet. If they do another game, I think it should totally have it so you can have a blade in one hand and a blaster in the other. Like, literally, if you had a, a gun in your left hand and a blade in your right hand, you can operate like that. Don't tell me you can't. The weapon I want is what the droids on Grievous' ship had, that, oh, that spear staff? with the, that staff you with the double blade on it. You can kind of get that. There's I a, want one of those. You can kind of get that. There's a retractable staff pike thing that does actually a pretty good amount of damage. But once you get a lightsaber, you really don't want anything else. Because well, you can customize the lightsabers like Yes, fucking there's crazy. more you can do with a lightsaber than yeah. with an electro yeah. lance. I get that. Like, you I can add crystals and shit. <laughs> Alright, so... Even though he won't be with us for very long... 
He's part of the party. The ship will blow up and he will take down with the I'm pretty ship. sure I have the security ability. I don't. Okay. Oh, the black and white buttons are now the LB and RB, which I've always enjoyed. Like, it's the same amount of buttons. They just move the black and white. People are like, oh, I wish they'd bring the black and white buttons back. They exist. It's the RB and LB. You're just stupid and pedantic, and you have nothing else going on in your life, so you have to complain about Xbox controllers not having old buttons that you probably weren't even old enough to remember in the first place. You shut up. I hated the Duke. Yeah, no, the Duke control. Oh my god. No, so I had one for a while. Remember the anniversary edition? Actually, yeah. Look, it's right here. It fucking. Like, yeah. I something, cannot. something glitched on this. I can't remember what it was. I would love to plug it in and figure out what it was. But yeah, something in the buttons glitched on me. Reboot the software. Yeah, maybe. I don't even know how to do that. I don't know how to. Do, have you seen me? I'm not. A, I'm not a geek. I'm a nerd. Huge difference. I like how it's like your journal is updated and you will never look at your journal. <laughs> that door's locked. Alright, then you do the security on the door, handsome. You can, like, pick the face that pretty much looks like his face, too. Oh god, it's a Mass Effect shotgun and rifle. I mean, this is the same company that made Mass Effect. You know? I know! Bioware. Bioware, back when Bioware was dope. Oh, wait, yeah. let's just do it. They were good. I just didn't realize they reused assets. Ah, kind of. But that was literally the Mass Effect shotgun. I like how you're doing the Han Solo pose, though. Might be a good idea to use one now before our next battle. All right, man. I don't think I need a med pack, though. So let's just get going. I can only look at Trask. Okay. Yeah, he's kind of a fan favorite for people. They're like, oh, it's too bad he had to die. It's like, is it? Is it really he? furthered the story by that. Uh, yeah, like, he, he's just, he's here, man, and then he's gone. It's fine. You know what? Let's try to be like a blaster-wielding Jedi. That would be fun. I haven't done that before. Actually, to be fair, Finn would make a great blaster-wielding Jedi, because he's really trained with blasters, being a stormtrooper and everything, and then, like, having force powers would really be beneficial. Not every Jedi needs to wield a lightsaber, guys. Well, you don't like the bread? You didn't like that bad, terrible interpretation of a croissant? No, I don't like the lettuce. Yeah, no, that lettuce is wilted as shit. Yeah, I, I could have gave like... you better stuff. I have like spinach and like. I don't actually do spinach. I'll do. It's just regular spinach. It's not like wilted spinach. It's not like boiled or anything. It's just like spinach is good for you, man. Popeye ate it. Yeah, look at the tumors he had. Pop by the sailor, man. I live in a garbage can. <laughs> I turn off the wiener and turn on the heater. Turn on the sailor, man. No, it's turn off the turn on the heater and blew off his wiener. Heater, the sailor, yeah, I remember that from when I was a kid. Oh shit, I'm about to die. I need to put a stem pack in my butt. Ah, uh, there you it have is. Not been paying attention. No, I need what I need is a blaster. I mean, a sword. Oh, oh my god, what I need is two swords. That's a long sword, that's... Oh, sweet. Yeah, they have swords in this game. Well, they're called vibroblades. Okay, I know what that is. It vibrates at a frequency that can uh, contend with a lightsaber if you yeah, have a duel. It's, yep, exactly what it is. Which allows other people to not just get shot down by your lightsabers immediately. It's not quite a sword, but it's more... It shifts sideways rapidly between four millimeters of distance that it rotates rapidly back and forth, which is wow, why it contends you. with it. You're exactly right. I feel like that one lady who runs that show QI, where it's like, wow, look at you, you got your facts right. That's amazing. Usually the comedians they bring on this show are fucking dumbasses. No, but seriously, there's this British show called QI. Basically, it's this very smart comedian lady named Sandy, and she has one regular guy and then three other comedians, and they rotate through all their British comedians. And basically, the concept is, you know, they kind of quiz them on what they know. And you'd be surprised at what people know. So let's see. What, what was I going to... That is actually a pretty cool-looking sword for just standard. Right. Okay, solo mode was on. There we go. 
That's what I was worried about. Solo mode. You don't want to. You want to be careful about solo mode. Oh, here we go. Lightsabers. Oh shit. Come on, you can do it. She can't though. I know. It's oh wait, no, she can, but then she dies from an explosion. And too bad we can't just take her lightsaber or anything like that. Because no, that would be desecration of a corpse. Yeah, no, God knows we don't do that in RPG games. No, that would be disrespectful to a fallen soldier. Nah, not like with these guys who I literally just raided for their stuff earlier. <laughs> Stab so basically back. what it is, so you got this little bar of stuff. You got your basic attack, and then as you unlock more attacks, that second option will have them, and then you have your non-battle when you get up, when you get Elden Ring and you get up behind oh, wait, someone, I you can get to look at stab them in the spine. Oh, she's got a vibration cell. Cool, that actually... Oh, that'll strengthen your sword. Yep. Awesome. So, she... Her sacrifice was not for nothing. Can I unlock this? Oh. Oh, yeah, but you're gonna get your ass kicked. I like how it said impossible, even though I did it, though. Come on, you Oh, can... I got a level up. Oh. Do it. Ah. That's actually fast. Faster than I thought would do. Oh no, this game is very lenient on you. Like, it's not injury. Lenient. Treat injury because you oh, got your no, ass I can't. Look, 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 I can't do anything. See, it doesn't. Oh, end. that's. Oh, that's dick move, bro. Let's go with the uh, computer use. We actually are going to need more than that than you think. And, um. Oh, we can. Can we Level add another? Level 4 requirement. Uh. Okay, so. Uh, let's see. what else do you got? We got Flurry, which gives me another move, which is more like cha 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 cha, like going real fast with blades. Except for a minus four defense, though. Nah. Sorry, I played a lot of D and D in Pathfinder. I see some of these things; they're great, but they take away your defenses. Implant level is probably a good thing to get because you can get implants that make you more better. Scroll down on the thing so I can see what else is it. That's all the way. I. Uh, yeah, that I think we should go like with yeah. I think we should go with that, right? We don't have any yet, but when we get them, we're gonna. Be It'll amplify their effects. Yeah, it's gonna be. This guy's slicing you up. Yeah, I mean, he's not doing. That's my health right here. For those who don't know, Draven is red color blind. It sucks. Yeah, he's missing a lot. That jacket is red. He's mostly covered in red. The hallway has a bit of red going on, but all this motherfucker sees is gray. It's not something you want to fucking uh, deal with. And unlike most modern games, this game does not have the ability to... To, to change the colors, yeah. Like, in for future games when we play, I'm actually going to actively change it just so he can see it. Because it doesn't bother me at all if instead of red, it's green. I don't give a shit. I'm just... I'm I, not that fucking pedantics. I turned reds, it, reds into greens or yellows. Do you hear what I said? I'm not that pedantics. I'll try to hold so anyone who's watching who is pedantic, it's fucking pedantic. <laughs> There's no S. <laughs> oh, oh, he's gone. Oh no, he's dead now. That's he's like come back we, to his daddy. That's like there's a certain number of the population that will yeah. get upset with the word I'm about to say. Moist. Oh yeah, <laughs> moist. <laughs> Oh, baby, you like a nice and Oh, voice. so many people have a problem with oh, that word, me, and I don't know why. Let me, let me rub your nipples and make it nice and moist. All right, uh, that's probably why they have a problem with it. Oh, uh, make it nice and moist, baby. Oh, <coughs> uh, make you so moist, you little fucking whore. Oh, you'll be so moist you want to suck a dick, and then I'll make my dick nice and moist. Oh, you know what makes me moist? Princess Leia in her little slave outfit. You know who else was moist? Jabba the Hutt. He was nice and moist. Going over there. Oh, he was licking all over her. Dirty man. Dirty man. Okay, this this entire thing is going to be called We Get Moist Over Star Wars. That's that's the name of this one. We get moist <laughs> over Star Wars. Uh, sometimes, yes. Uh, dude, sometimes I like listen. Like, I, like 
I don't like Ray that much, but Daisy really just does it for me. I don't know if you've seen her in an interview, but she's got a fucking potty mouth. She's fucking hilarious. No, I've just seen the uh, porn parody of that scene. Well, everybody likes that porn parody of that scene. Yes, they do. It's like to anybody out there who's seen the the the. Oh, Ru you have grenades. Yeah, I do have grenades. There's a, a Rooster Teeth show called Ruby. <laughs> And people have done um, porn with the character Rose. I know. And then there's this cosplaying chick who's like this cute, adorable... She's like 23. But, but she looks like she's 14. And she does Ruby. And it's just like, does she know? Does she know she's does feeding she, some does she weird, know sick she's perversion? Feeding, oh, really? Per oh, man. Weird, sick perversion oh, with the look? No. Man. Like, don't get me wrong, I was one of those weird kids who grew up with Red vs. Blue who jerked off to porn about Tex, but, like... I was already 18 by the time Stephen hey, 1 was Hey, man, Tex out. was, like, in her 20s, so, you know. Yeah, I was 18 when that story came out, so I... It's... Oh, I love Red vs. Blue. I, like, I mean, there's she a reason... She always kicks. So, so if y'all know me from, like, the early days, I used to be known as Leonard Church or Lunatic Leonard. That's literally the name of Leonard Church, Private Church, the, the, of the blue team. The, the, the original Like, the guy soldier. I kind of sound like and act like, which is why I took his name. Because we kind of had the similar... Even all these years later. Which is why, after they killed off his character, I stopped fucking watching. Like, you lost a fan. You killed off my favorite character. Die! Okay, so we look at these guys, right? It's like, oh, security cams. Yeah, can you use a security... Pop. Can you overload a station to blow them up? Yes, you can! Awesome! Yes, and praise Jesus! Uh, praise Anakin Skywalker, the space oh. Jesus! Yes, he has come to us to protect us from the dark lord of the Sith by becoming his apprentice for 20 years, killing like millions of people, and hey, then I finally the turning on I him. I joined the Sith when I was eight years old. Oh, oh no, hold on, hold on. Come on, we can hide out on the planet below. You say that shit. Did I save this picture? I really hope I saved it. Oh, is it the little girl who bows to No, 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 no. No, first of all, check out my, check out this. It's Dark Side Ray with a nice booty. Right? Yeah. That's a great picture. I would lick that all day long. Like, da Daisy Ridley, if you're watching, you're so beautiful. Ray is a so-so character who I'm okay with, but, like, you are so beautiful, it makes me want to cry. Um, did I save that, that, that thing? No. So, I guess I didn't. So, Dave Filoni, who is currently in charge of a lot of Star Wars right now. No, 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 no. This guy made the Clone Wars and everything okay. like that. Like, this guy knows Star Wars. Like, okay. if I'm giving you respect for knowing Star Wars, you know Star Wars. And he said, stop looking at the dark side as a way to gain power. Anakin Skywalker was a broken, shitty fucking person. And the dark side just broke him even further. The Look dark at what side happened to fucking ben Like, don't Solo. get me wrong. You don't need to be a fucking Jedi, okay? Like, Jedi also suck. What you need to do is find balance in yourself. And through that, you will find balance in the Force. Find balance between the universe and the Focal Alliance and... The dark side of the light side of the By force. By the way, just being a soldier of the Republic doesn't make you trustworthy, buddy. I'm just pointing that out right now. Oh no, some of them are corrupt as fuck. Yeah, but at this point, I I'm willing to get off this fucking ship with you. And while we're getting off this ship, I'm going to take a fucking piss. Pisa. As the ship crashes into the planet. Oh no, they're gone. It, they blew it up. Those bastards. And what are you going to bounce off of? Oh, shit. Right into a building.